Every night, we see a sky full of stars. But did you know that there is a mysterious object behind that sky? Introducing the black hole. This object exists throughout the universe, but it remains mysterious to this day. So mysterious that many people ask, what exactly is a black hole? A black hole is technically a space in the cosmos with extremely strong gravity. A black hole consists of two parts, the singularity and the event horizon. The singularity is still very mysterious, and its contents are unknown. The event horizon, on the other hand, is a region with such strong gravitational force that nothing in the universe can escape its pull, including light, the fastest object in our universe. Because there is no light around it, a black hole cannot be seen. So, if it cannot be seen, how do we know a black hole exists? We can know by observing the effects of a black hole's gravity on surrounding objects. For example, here is a simulation of a galaxy passing by a black hole. Due to its high gravitational force, a black hole can bend light, allowing us to detect it. Additionally, a black hole can be detected by observing the orbits of outer space objects, which often have strange orbits because they are influenced by the gravity of a nearby black hole. So, what happens if we enter a black hole? In short, we will experience a phenomenon that researchers call spaghettification, where our body's molecules will be torn apart and merge with the singularity. A black hole is formed from a massive star that has exhausted its fuel. Imagine a star that is very large, 20 times the size of our sun or more, running out of its fuel. Over time, this dead star will collapse under its own gravity, becoming a single point called the singularity, and then a black hole is formed. Interestingly, mathematically, everything in the world can become a black hole, including us. Yes, that's right. We can become a black hole by compressing ourselves, assuming our body mass is 70 kilograms into one yachtometer, which is extremely small. We have become a black hole. Similarly, if we compress our Earth to about the size of a peanut, it will also become a black hole. But don't worry, naturally, we cannot become a black hole because our mass is too small. Even our sun does not have enough mass to become a black hole. So, hopefully, this video makes you more amazed and curious about our incredible and mysterious universe. And hopefully, this video does not just consume your internet data like a black hole's pull. Thank you.